of my Birkin 25. This one here is my Birkin 25 centimeters in black Togo leather and gold hardware. She's so cute. I really love her perfect neutral really. Um, and for me, I find the 25 centimeters to be such a great size because it's not too heavy. Do, 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 Welcome to Kiki's channel. Do, do. Ding, ding. Oh, hi, dear. Hi, everyone. Today, I'd like to show you guys a couple mod shots, um, try-ons of my Birkin 25. This one here is my Birkin 25 centimeters in black Togo leather and gold hardware. She's so cute. I really love her perfect neutral really. Um, and for me, I find the 25 centimeters to be such a great size because it's not too heavy. And I just want to note though that I don't have a 30 centimeters. I may add one to my collection, but at the moment I don't have one to compare. But I do have to say, so far with the 25 centimeters, I've been loving them. Anyway, back to modeling shots. So, um, how shall we do this? So today's outfit is just really simple because I'm usually pretty casual anyway. And especially if I wear Birkins, I don't like to be too dressed up. I think they're a pretty casual bag. With a caveat that, oh, give me one second. I think our buddy here, excuse me, are you? No. Okay, what was I at? Um, but the caveat that the 25 centimeters is, I think, something that you can actually wear to more formal events as compared to a 30 centimeter or a larger Birkin. But still, it's not the most, like, you know, gala event. Not that I go to any galas, but you know what I mean. For those of you that do, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> and give me another second. Excuse you. Okay, I'm just going to have to... Okay. All right, where were I? where was I? All right, so back to what I'm wearing today. So pretty casual as usual. I'm wearing a Uniqlo collaboration with Paul and Joe t-shirt, Victoria's Secret leggings, and Hermes um, slide wheels. Pretty simple. I guess the beauty of having a neutral bag is you could wear a lot of color, but I don't normally wear a lot of color anyway. So that kind of works out. I really like outfits that are monochromatic. So same tone, same color, same, 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 same. Just easy on the eyes to me. Come on, bro. You don't cause trouble. Ding, ding. And here I want to show you a lot of um, people say that because of the size of the handles being proportionate or maybe disproportionate even to, excuse me, to the bag, it's difficult for some people to wear it um, through to your, the crook of your arm. So like this, I find that I can, but I would definitely agree that it's not, probably for the vast majority of people, I would say probably cannot wear it like this. It's going to be strictly a kind of a finger carry, hand carry thing, which could be a deal breaker. For me, it hasn't been, but it could be for you. So that's just something to note. Um, I found that it to be very comfortable and it would have been, I think personally to me, a deal breaker if I couldn't put it through at, at the crook of my arm, just because sometimes I'm a mom and sometimes you just need your hands to do stuff like grab you ha. and hand me, you peasant. What? What? Did, what? Let me go. Let me hold me. Moon puppy. <laughs> I personally love pairing it with these kind of super plain, casual outfits. The sweater I got from Muji a year or two ago. 
just because I think the bag already says enough and you just don't want it to be too busy. But if you like a super, super busy look, you should totally do you too. This is how I usually wear it. So the sweater, it would be harder to put up onto the crook of your arm. So it would be a wrist carry for me in that case, unless I pull my sweater up. So I would have to actually have two hands to do this, holding the phone with the other hand, and then I can slip it down onto the crook of my arm. But it would require the use of both hands, but I guess normally day to day, I will not be holding my phone <laughs> and vlogging at the same time. But so here you can see, you can wear a thickish sweater. I mean, I guess it would be like a medium, medium thick sweater and still wear it like that, which I really love the look. If Hermes would only make this handle longer, I feel like, I mean, it'd be a game changer, but at the same time, the bag is already so sought after. They probably think they don't need to, but imagine how nice that would be. So many more people would be able to do this and yeah, it'd be more useful. It'd also be easier, I think, to use as a handheld if it were just like an inch or something longer on the, the handle. Back up again. Holding in the other hand. I guess 90% of the time it's going to be like this and then 10, 20% of the time will be a crook of the arm kind of thing. Stuff against the body for you to see the size difference. And you know, I really kind of want a size 30 because you know what they say, or who says this? Maybe I say this. And I'm really considering a size 30 because I feel like I don't mind the weight of this 25 since I carry very little. And a 30 centimeter I think would be great for the winter, especially ha to have really thick parkas if you're in a colder climate, kind of like where I am in Canada. Um, that way I could put it in the crook of the arm because what I find inconvenient about this is if I were to wear a thicker jacket, parka or what have you, it is basically impossible to put through the sleeve, right? As you guys saw, the sweater barely goes through. So I think that would be great because then I won't have to hand carry it. Don't have to wear gloves because I'm super lazy. That would be nice. Give it more options. But I'm still kind of on the fence. I haven't, I don't know if I need to add another Birkin to my collection. I feel like because I have two already and they're both neutrals and whether that's just go, going overboard. So yeah, let me know your thoughts. Do you guys like the size 25 centimeters or the 30 centimeters more? And also let me know if you guys like the Birkin at all. I made another video yesterday and I'm not sure which one I'll upload first. Because I had some um, issues with the other the footage uh, about the Birkins and you know the Birkin hype la di da di do. So I'd really love to know what you guys think of Hermes, what you guys think of Birkins, and if you want me to do any more kind of videos like this. All right, so thank you guys so much for watching my video. What do you guys think? Do you like how the twenty five centimeter looks on? Um, do you guys have one of your own or perhaps one in a different size? What's your opinion on the Birkin in general or Hermes? Thank you guys again so, 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 so much for watching. If you have any questions for me or about my bags in general or any suggestions for new videos, please let me know um, in the comment box below. This isn't cough. Who are you? You silly. <laughs> Please let me know and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye. Yeah. Ding ding. Do, 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 do. Thanks for watching. Come again. Bye bye.